my muchachos Grab a beer and turn on YouTube Time to watch the Squatchy Brew Dude Oh yeah Squatchy Brew Dude's heading down to Tucson Yo see your fiestas, what Gronk would say Can't wait to hit Pueblo Vida Bruin And drink a killer hazy IPA Whoa, you watching Squatchy Brew Dude Hola muchachos, I'm with Playboy Pat here in Sabino Canyon And we are Sasquatch hunting A lot of people around, I don't think we're going to see them It's very busy, need to come here a little earlier but I'm not discouraged. Wait, is that one in the background? I heard a noise, a howl. Oh. That is a Sasquatch. And I'm hoping some of these breweries use Sasquatch hairs in their beer because it gives that unique flavor that just puts it over the top in the finish of your beer. Okay, folks, I'm a little worried because this is reminding me of Grown Ups too, and I hope there's not some guy doing backflips that's gonna make me jump naked into the water with Higgins. Worse than a bear sighting though, is freaking little kids sighting, and they're loud. Get off my lawn! This looks like the famous footage that I've seen a million times on all the Bigfoot shows, Finding Bigfoot Cliff. Doesn't it look like when the guy in California, where you, he was walking around? Definitely check out Sabino Canyon. What do you think, Clayboy Pat? I think it's pretty cool. Definitely come back. Yeah, we gotta do the waterfall hike. The real waterfall hike. There's some way bigger hikes. We. I came to hear brewery. I did. I, I hit breweries today. I am. I did not going to be all day Grizzly Adams stuff. So, yeah, beautiful, beautiful. Weather's nice now. Oh, that breeze. I have earned myself some beer. Yes, got some steps in. Got my steps in. Let's go. When I go on a Squatchy Brew Dude adventure, I always try to get some outdoor time. You know, I hear some of these guys go on vacation and all they do is get breweries, man. You gotta get your vitamin D, babe. Freaking beautiful here. This weather is absolutely insane. That breeze, these cactus mountains, some coyotes. I saw Wiley Coyote, only bad thing. Some flying anvils around here, baby. Watch out, it's a little dangerous. Hola muchachos, made it to the Pueblo Vida Brewing Company. And I'm drinking the Hazy IPA, 100% Galaxy Hops from New Zealand. My boy Nate is actually in Australia and New Zealand. Let's throw a shrimp on the bobby. That's not. All right, beer number one of Tucson. Tucson Visit 2.0. Great to be back in Tucson. Oh, that's good. A little bitter in the finish. Wow. I'm getting pineapple. I'm getting tangerine. I'm getting some Sasquatch hairs. It's, it, it comes in. It's an aggressively hopped beer here, man. Uh, it's juicy. And then when you hit it, it's got a little more kick towards the end. So if you're not a like that bitter finish, you might not like this beer. It's good. I like it. Hello, hello. Oh. I love when you find believers. I got a serious IPA, or however you call oh, Citra and Strata, Mosaic Hops. Holy shit, this is gonna be good. I'm getting, I'm getting orange off the top here. I don't know if I feel if it's peeled or if it's the just the juiciness of it. Oh, I definitely get the orange. I get a slight tinge of Bigfoot armpit hairs. 
a little bit of peach. Very, very nice beer. Uh, this is like 6%, six and a half. Very, quite refreshing. I, oh, I could just, I could go waste management on these. I could have two on each side, just go, 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 go. And it's a nice, solid, bitter finish. It's good, they have solid beer here. Tucson, baby. I gotta come down here more often. Yes. Gronk. Gronk and me, I need to do some chugging. A uh, chug contest. So one of my things on the brewery and food network is I wanna have celebrity beer chugging. Wouldn't that be great? Couldn't you see like Rob Gronkowski going like up against, uh, I don't know, Adam Sandler or something? Let's make it happen, let's go. driver got me a little bit lost. <laughs> Excuse me, I was supposed to give a lecture at the medical center. All right, Moto Sonora Brewing here in beautiful Tucson. Can you see the mountains back there? Wow, it is just a majestic day. These mountains are beautiful. This place is actually pretty cool. Coming in this oasis of a beautiful brewery. I'll give you an inside of the tap room. I got a hazy IPA. This is where the uh, sexy magic happens, folks. Here, let's go. Spent grains. Yes. Hola, muchachos. Yeah, the hazy IPA at Modo Sonora Brewing. Yeah. Oh my God, it's so beautiful here in Tucson. So it's a little bitter. I'm getting pineapple, a little bit of tangerine. Not a huge aroma off the nose. My nose is kind of clogged, so. Uh, man, this is a killer spot. I love this patio, it's nice. Here, next beer here is Super Fogiomo Fogimato Imperial Saison with peppercorns. Yeah. Oh, that's a mouthful. Yeah, I do get that Belgian -y yeast that really is kind of pungent off the nose. Very effervescent. I'm not feeling any peppercorns. It's a very drinkable beer, very good. Inside the tap room. Uh, we're gonna go with a Sonoran dog. Never had a Sonoran dog. I'm kind of creeped out with mayonnaise on a hot dog, but it's wrapped in bacon, so holy shit, that's gonna be good. We're gonna try the Sonoran dog. Um, Moto Soto, really cool spot. That Saison really kicked ass. Hola muchachos at gonna try the Sonoran hot dog. Never had a Sonoran hot dog. Got bacon wrapped in a hot dog from El Goro Canelo Mexicano food here in beautiful Tucsano, Arizona. Yo soy fiesta. Let's go. Okay folks. I'm at El Guero Canelo Mexicano food. Yo soy fiesta, bro. Sonoran dog. It's got mustard. Frick, who puts mayonnaise on a hot dog? Kind of creeps me out. We got tomatoes. Supposedly the hot dog is wrapped in bacon. This sounds insane. Let's go. First Sonoran dog. Hey, let's watch your beer, dude. Tucson, Arizona. Don't disappoint. Oh, 
Oh man. Got some grilled onions. <laughs> this is nuts. Mexican Coke. Wow. All right, here you go. Oh, dropping all my stuff here. Oh, I'm getting that bacon. Oh my God. Freaking insane. We have to eat these on a game. <laughs> Do some, baby. Yo soy fiesta. Final stop of uh, beautiful Tucson Dragoon Brewing. Oops, it's like really dark in here. I feel like I'm in a freaking mortuary. Um, Dragoon Brewing I got a number six. It's the Pina Calabra. It's a tropical IPA with my bros from Bottle Logic. It's kind of cool, other than the fact it's dark in here and there's no TVs. And I want to watch the San Diego State beat Alabama. So I'm getting a little bit of coconut. I don't know, the hazies in Tucson, they love to hit with a bitter finish, which is kind of cool. It's a little different. At least to, the hazies I usually drink are a little softer. Get slight coconut, a little bit of pineapple. Oh, yeah. Oh, coconut really hits you at the finish. Yeah, it's pretty good. Get a TV here. Let's go Aztecs. Playboy Pat punched me in the neck at the last place. He's like, where's the damn TVs? My freaking Aztecs are playing. What the bleep, 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 bleep. Boy, we're going to a place with a TV, 1912. Supposedly, I saw it from the internet they have TVs. I mean, who the hell doesn't have a TV in a bar? Branch and Bone, Ren House. You guys need to be caned. You guys need to get your shit together. Look at these mountains. Look at these trees. I love Tucson. I'm staying low. Oh, Gary Newman. Gary Newman's going to give me a copyright infringement. Man, this is really bad. Um, I thought Tucson was a basketball town, but we can't get a game on at any breweries. Rob Gronkowski, you need to open up a, a brewery in town, or at least a bar. We can call it Gronks. And we could put March Madness games on. What a novel concept. This is insane. I'm going to try the Pilsner. Very, oh, this is very good. Chris. Bright. I'm getting... Just the right amount of bitterness. I mean, it's a little bitter in the finish. Getting that Saz hops. Well done. That's a cool spot. Other than that, there's no game on. This is just freaking pathetic. I'm at 1912 Brewery. And look, we have to watch the San Diego State game on an iPhone. Do better. Kronkowski, you need to open up a brewery in Tucson. Talk to me. All right, folks, last beer in Tucson. My driver is going to take me to my the medical center for my talk. I'm drinking Don't Thank the Funk. It's a sour cherry. Is it a framboise? A framboise? I don't know. I'm not one of those. What do you call them? Cicerones. Very cherry, very boozy. Oh, wow. The 
Ah. This might take a while to drink. This is interesting. Sour versus the squash. San Diego State's getting thumped now. It's not looking good. Would I get this again? Probably not. It's been a fun day here in uh, Tucson, my second visit. Tucson 2.0. Tried four different breweries that I haven't been to before. I've had the beer at Dragoon before the IPA. It's, it's pretty good. Uh, my favorite brewery was Pueblo Vida. The hazies really stuck, stuck out. The place wasn't sexy, but it was very good. Really loved the setup at Moto Soto. Maybe my second favorite. 1912, they have some really good beers. The Pilsner is really good. This beer just, I think I ordered the wrong one. It's a little too sour for me. That's a cool place other than I just wish I could watch NCAA basketball. I feel like I'm in Asheville. Two years ago, I was in Asheville. I give a, I want to give props to Catawba because they had the games on. Everyone else sucked ass. Come on, guys. Some beer people like sports. I mean, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Squatchy Purdue beer visits. And I think I'm, oh, I'm going to be in Cleveland next weekend. Yes. I guarantee you, if you went to Cleveland, sports would be on. Well, my friends, the time has come to raise their roof and have some fun. Throw away their work to be done. Aztecs crushed Bama today, today, today. Yeah, let's go, Aztecs. Yeah, bring it home. Final four, baby. Let's go.